Pleasure to meet you, man. I appreciate you having me, man. Salute, salute, salute. Sir. Ah, <laughs> tell these niggas. What up, world? BA for real, 100. Welcome to get your bars up. Media salute, salute, salute. Uh, so we are back up in this thing, and first and foremost, I want to say R.I.P. to Shanquella Robinson, um, young melanated queen. Went out to Cabo. Some crazy stuff happened to her. Uh, I don't know if she got jumped or whatnot. Went out there with some friends. Friends went, came back home without her. Next thing you know, Shanquilla is out of there. R.I.P. Condolences, condolences to her family and her friends, her real friends and family. You feel me? Her real friends because it's, it's a janky story. But anyways, transitioning over. So Jazz the Rapper. Shouts out to Jazz the Rapper. Shout out to Jazz the Rapper. I heard her talking today on Spaces. Cause I don't really have time to be on spaces like that because I'm always grinding doing something trying to get some bread you already know um, but with that being said uh, Jazz it spoke on something uh, and, and it was in regards to um, I guess a conversation that she had between her and uh, her 40 bars uh, E-Heart Hustle even jumped on there and, and, uh, and a couple other people right and they were talking about turnouts and how many tickets you sell, how many fans you have, yada, yada, yada. I want to say this. Jazz the rapper, what she is doing for female battle rap needs to be respected. I want to say that because I'm one of her toughest critics, y'all. I'm going to keep it 100. I, I was like, man, she ain't going to be Gaddis. Nah. She kicked Gaddis' ass. Oh, she ain't going to be Vixen. She kicked Vixen ass too. Ah, and she did it convincingly. Easy and clear. Clear, super clear. Uh, solidifying her GOAT status, even though she was one of the GOATs before this, to me. To me. Uh, but with that being said, what Jazz the Rapper is doing for female battle rap to me right now is incredible. It's incredible to me. And I feel like we need to be looking at uh, the ladies who are hating on her right now, or not liking or feeling, or feeling her or whatnot because they upset for whatever reason, status, oh, she's super cool, and all of that with you are real. No, forget looking at all of that. Look at how, what she's doing. She is letting, she's she's showing, she's she's creating a blueprint before, uh, before your eyes on how to make a bag. She's even, she don't even, she's not even, a, she don't even got a job no more. She ain't even a dispatcher no more. She making money strictly off of battle rap as a female, which I know is a tough thing to do because females don't be getting a bag. And shout out to Remy Ma. Remy Ma is going to come out with a $25,000 tournament, which she's already having. Or she's going to give, she's going to have one card every so, every blue moon for $10,000. $10,000 ain't no money for real. I know that's a lot to a lot of y'all for one battle and everything, etc. But $10,000 ain't going to support you for a whole year. But what Jazz is doing is she is milking the system. And what she's doing is she's creating with her winning, with popularity, getting on these bigger cards. She is creating a system for the ladies to follow, a blueprint for the ladies to follow. So in the future, a year, two years from now, guess what? Yeah, she can. Hey, y'all can get bags, too. Y'all can get bags every card three, four times a year, not just one event a year. Where these other events where, okay, you get 1500 for there, you get 500 here. Nah, y'all can go out and get bags now. So let her do what she do. That's my whole point of this blog. Salute to her. Congratulations to female battle, the female battle rap culture. Because that's what Jazz is doing right now. I know she's a little cocky in her approach, you feel me? Because that's Jazz. Jazz is a, a big bag, Jazz. Yeah, all of that shit. I know. I know that's what y'all see. Y'all see arrogance. But if you look at the big, bigger picture, what she is doing for the culture is super crazy. It's super crazy. Like, Jazz right now could actually, she's, she could actually, like, we talking about Wody and everybody talking about, oh, yeah, female battle rapper of the year. She could actually, she's in a running for battle rapper of the year. Not just female, not just Wody, woman of the year. Nah, she said she's in contention of actual battle rapper of the year. Period. Period. So, because I don't want to make this blog too long, but let's just give her a flowers. And if you a hater, just shut the fuck up and just watch what she's doing. And if you don't think what she's doing is, is super great for the culture of female battle rap, then guess what you need to do? 
you do the shit. You do it your own way, and then you make noise, and let's see what you do for the culture from then on, from, from here on out. You be that voice. Because right now, she the only person that's actually beat niggas and, 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 and beating women, and she's doing it at a bigger scale, and she's demanding money that she is getting. So instead of hating, talk to her behind the scenes, man. Say what's up. See how you can do that because not only is she doing not not only is she that that she's that she's making big moments for the ladies for the female culture because this ain't just for Jazz the rapper. Jazz the rapper is already Jazz the rapper. But not only is she doing not only is she making money from the culture and and, and, and putting on for the culture, she's actually traveling and she's developing relationships with different companies outside of battle rap, doing other things and using her name for that. And if we go back to the culture, she's actually traveling around to different places, uh, uh, different events, smaller leagues, getting bags for just hosting all around the country. And then she's going outside of the country doing this too. Who else, What other ladies is doing it? I know, I know we got 40, shout out to 40 bars. Oh, I'm the most viewed and all of that. That's cool. I, I, that's, that's dope, Queen. That's dope, Queen. Shout out to E Heart. Probably the best lyricist out of all the like the best ly- female lyricist of all time in battle rap maybe possibly shout out to her too but come on man shout out to hustle she's 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 signed with death row allegedly and all of this stuff she's trying to rap and all of that stuff blah, blah, blah. but for female battle rap the culture right now what jazz is doing don't hate don't hate build on your own legacy and do what you do do what you do ladies See what she's doing. See what you can get from that and try to push the culture forward your way. Try to increase these bags for the ladies. And like I said, Remy Ma, it's only so much she could do. It's only so much Remy could do. I need some of you artists to step up because this was a big year for female battle rap in general. Check the check, check it out. The last couple years have been huge for female battle rap. But it's only one person right now that's really holding that torch. And she's the man in the bag. That's a lady. She goes by the name of Jazz the Rapper. But anyways, I got to get up out of here and get back to work. This your boy, BA For Real 100. This is Get Your Bars Up Media. If this is your first time here, click that subscribe button. You rock with me, I rock with you. And if you out there hating, just because you think I'm a new guy and you just not stumbled upon my page and I've been doing this for a minute, <laughs> then all I can truly say is thank you for coming and get your bars up. Salute, subscribe, all that good stuff. Y'all tell me what y'all think about what Jazz is doing for the ladies in the culture now. And hey... Y'all tell me if y'all think that Jazz is actually one of the best battle rappers in the world opposed to just um, uh, uh, the best female battle rapper. Because it looks like she is distorting that line right now. Like she's blending that line in. And I feel like we need that. I feel like we need that. And I feel like the ladies need that in general. Because it's a lot of talent in that talent pool. Period. Anyways, peace and love. We'll be back. Salute.